Get ready to feel the burn, not in the workout, but in what you eat, how you can compete in fat eateries, hot and spicy Lexa challenge while supporting a great cause. All of that happening today on Houston Life. who's at Fat Eatery heating things up for a great cause. Tell us all about it, Joe. Oh yeah, Courtney, Derek, so we're in Katy, Asia Town, and we're gonna be talking all about the hot and spicy Luxa Challenge that they're gonna be doing here, all supporting such a great cause, the Ballard House. We're gonna be telling you about them when we return on Houston Life, and I can't wait to taste. It is absolutely delicious. We'll be right back with more Houston Life after a quick break. On chilly days, what better way to warm up than with a hot and spicy bowl of Luxa, which is a spicy noodle soup from Southeast Asia. Fat Eatery is calling all spice lovers to put their skills to the test while helping support the Ballard House. Joe Sam is there now seeing how this competition is really heating up. Hey, Joe. Hey, Courtney Derek, yeah, the Ballard House, a really cool organization. We're going to talk to you about them in just a little bit. But take a look at this restaurant here at Fat Eatery. It really is cool. Like the aesthetic of it, it feels like you walk back into time. And I just love all of the different billboards that's up here. It's going to be the same vibe that you're getting when you come here for the challenge that's going to be happening. I'm going to take a seat with my guy here, Alex, to talk all about it. He's the owner here at Fat Eatery. And the Ballard House, such a cool organization. We know that they are a local nonprofit that provides temporary housing to those who are going through any type of medical treatment or who are hospitalized. Talk a little bit more about why you decided to support them once again. Since we opened Fat Italy, Ballard House has been always our favorite church organization. Mm -hmm. And for a lot of like uh, the foodie group here, uh, KD for Ben Foodies, and we all support Ballard House a lot. Uh, we, we really believe in them. Absolutely, and you are going to be supporting them once again with this amazing competition. Okay, so we have the Luxo up here, and I taste a little bit of the regular earlier, and that one was a little spicy too. So right now, this is the actual spicy, spicy Luxo. Go through the rules really quickly of the competition. Okay, you have one bowl. There's no, not another bowl you can like mix them up together. You have one bowl. You have 30 minutes to finish it with the broth and everything. Everything's in here. Yes. You see the milk and the water is for you after <laughs> you finish. And you said they have to wait at least five, five minutes, minutes to do it after, right? Yes, yes. Now, if they win, they're going to be getting prizes. They're going to get gift cards here, and they're also going to get this really cool shirt. Let me turn the shirt around so I can show people what that says. <laughs> Take a look at this here. <laughs> what the F? It says, wow, tasty food. You're going to get a shirt, you're going to get a gift card, and you're going to be also getting something really cool that you can give back to the community as well. We're going to talk a little bit more about that. And, Alex, you know what we're going to do? We're going to be tasting this, Courtney and Derek and we're going to put you to the challenge as well to tell you how spicy it really is. For right now, we're going to send things back to you guys in the studio as I get prepped up. Okay, and <laughs> there's the not a level, right? Like, you don't work up to it. It's one major hot, spicy soup. One and done. One and done. And you have to sign a waiver for it, too. Oh. We're going to tell you about that. Okay. <laughs> Uh-oh. We'll see you in a bit, Joe. Thanks. Talking with Joe Sam, who is getting fired up about a popular tasting challenge. Uh-oh. Hey, Joe. Hey, Courtney, that's right. So I have the waiver right here, getting ready to sign it for their Luxa Challenge that's going to be happening here at Fat Eatery. We're going to be telling you all about it when we come back here on Houston Life. But for right now, I have to prepare myself for this fiery challenge. Welcome back here to Houston Life. You know, we've been getting ready for this Luxa Challenge here at Fat Eatery. I am so excited, but I'm also so very scared. We just finished signing the waiver. As you can see down here, Paul had to witness it for me. Our photographer, he wrote down here, RIP. No support at all that we're getting <laughs> here. I'm here with Alex again, the owner at Fat Eatery, to talk about this challenge. I'm going to get ready to start tasting, but as I'm tasting, give people the information as far as when is the competition going to kick off again, and then you're going to explain to us what's actually in this to make it so spicy. This uh, Lassa Challenge is coming this Saturday at 11 p.m. 11 a.m. and you can register on our website or email to us at spicy at fateatery.com. All the proceeds go to uh, the Ballard House, 100% is for the good cause. 
Okay. Okay. Feeling? I'm ready. I have my milk. I have my water, and I have my bucket too, just in case. So I'm gonna start eating. You tell us exactly what kind of ingredients are in this, so that people can start. I'm scared. Paul's telling me to like, come on, but I'm nervous. Okay. It's a, it's, tell us what's in this. It's a traditional Southeast Asian, Singapore, Malaysian dish, but it's not supposed to be that <laughs> spicy. <laughs> we have ghost pepper, uh, Caroline Ripper, and Indian chili powder in it. And uh, oh. it, it's not for the faint of heart. I can tell, and they have to eat the entire bowl. Yes, in 30 minutes. And then you have to wait for 30 minutes before you touch the milk and the water. Mm. Uh, oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. I'm hearing know. a lot of sounds. <laughs> Okay, okay, Joe. Our waiver. We just signed right. our waivers, so they're it is out of the way. Spicy. You, you, oh, well, he spicy. lost the challenge. He went for the milk. So for each winner, we will donate another oh. hundred dollars to the Bolland House. Plus, they will get a fifty dollar <laughs> gift card and a T-shirt you saw earlier. Now so, I can deal wow. with spicy, but this is this is really spicy. So we're gonna go ahead and send things to Courtney and Derek. You guys have. <clears throat> You, excuse me, you got to have a waiver in the studio as well as two bowls yes. of yep. this, of the Luxa. <laughs> so, you have to try it it. Yeah. so Joe, while you take an, another sip of milk, please be sure you have water. We want to remind our viewers, for everyone who can finish <laughs> this bowl in under 30 minutes, $100 will be donated to Ballard House, mm. which is such a great organization. It helps house families who have a family member undergoing medical treatment, essentially. Go for it. I'm going to let you, you know talk okay? now because um, I almost felt it like it go. might be Ooh. worse when you stop eating. It de definitely gets you on the first bite. If you're a hot, it spicy person. It definitely starts to pick up the burn. Yeah. Ooh. What do you think, Dee? I mean, you're going to go for it, aren't you? With those, uh, I'll go for another one. Eat? They're trying we'll to get right, right now. Yeah. Yeah. They're trying to get right now in the studio. Oh. Ooh. Wow, that ghost pepper is not it's, hitting. It's good. Oh. Mm. I don't know if I can eat the whole bowl. No, no, I know I can't. Ooh, I know I, I can't, can't eat the whole bowl either. Holy so cow. you guys, good luck with that in the studio. Good luck, Joe. Oh, <laughs> all right, Joe. Uh, good job, though. All right. Wow. You keep going after the break. <coughs> Hang on, because the noodles hurt. I thought maybe would. No. <sighs> a look at what's coming up on tomorrow's show, including a hot fashion accessory you're going to want for the holiday season. I've had two bites and I'm already sweating on my face. I can't okay. feel my tongue. As we head to break, let's check in with Kevin Frazier for a look at what's coming up on Entertainment Tonight, including the bromance between two Hollywood heartthrobs. Hey, Kevin. You're so